Welcome back to Design Smith. In this video, I'm gonna show you how this design is done in Illustrator. This poster was one of my weekly favorites from last week, so if you haven't seen that, be sure to check it out right up here. Before we get started, please subscribe to support the channel. All right, so in the video that I did last week, I mentioned that it inspired this poster right over here. So what I'm gonna do is a combination of these two different things. What we're gonna end up with is a Michael Jordan 23 poster that is gonna combine both of these concepts together. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is move this over here to the side, and I'm going to create a rectangle right here, just fill up that entire space there. And temporarily, I'm just gonna turn this black. It's just easier to work with that way. This black will most likely become red, but we'll just see how it evolves. All right, let's move this a little bit over here, and I'm gonna type in our 23 right here. And we haven't gotten to the end of 2024 yet, so I am still not allowed to use Helvetica. All right, didn't really matter what the size is right here. All that we need to do is make sure that we get it nailed down exactly. I think we're gonna go to black instead of bold. And now I'm just gonna create outlines based on these. And now one thing that you wanna do is kinda get a general sense of what the size of both of these numbers are gonna be. So let's just enlarge this up. I'm gonna color drop and turn this white for a second. And I just realized that I accidentally used interstate instead of inter. So now that we've fixed that, we can proceed. All right, so let's get this to about right here. Let's color drop on the white and let's get it roughly to where it's gonna be. I don't wanna do an exact copy even though it doesn't really matter. Now we need to ungroup both of these and I'm gonna grab just the three right here. We'll move it maybe right around here. And we want to scale up this three a little bit so that it kind of matches this area right here. This top line needs to match that bottom line. Okay, that's looking good. And now let's just kind of give it a little bit of distance right there. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and lock this black background just temporarily. And now we'll select both of these. I'm gonna group them together really quickly just so we can get our exact placement. And I'm going to enlarge this up to, let's see, let's just kind of experiment a little bit. Okay, yeah, that's looking really nice. All right, now let's bring this over here so we can kind of bring in some of those colors. And now that I'm happy with the composition of the 23, I'm gonna go in here and double click and select these together and select this one shape and go over here to the Pathfinder and click on Unite. So now this is one continuous shape and we can no longer ungroup it. And now with this still selected, I'm gonna hit Copy and Paste in front. And now I'm gonna hit Enter on my keyboard and we're gonna move it over by one inch. So we're gonna do positive one inch there, positive one inch on vertical and hit copy. And now I'm gonna select black for this. And now we're gonna send it all the way to the back. And then we can just double click out of it and you can see that drop shadow there. And what I might do is color drop on this particular shadow and see what that looks like. Okay, I think I'll leave it black actually. After all, these are the colors of the Chicago Bulls. All right, now let's finish this out. I'm not gonna do a ton of content here, but I'm just gonna put in a few things. So we'll just kind of see what happens. All right, I think this is a very nice end result of combining both of these two outside designs together into one concept. And I think I'll go in here and put in Chicago Bulls right here at the bottom, and we'll do 15 right there. And we'll align it to that side, and then we'll put some spacing in between this here. I didn't actually create a grid for this, maybe I should have, but I think the overall composition looks really good. And here's our finished 23 Michael Jordan poster. We created that 23 by typing them out, creating outlines, ungrouping them, and then uniting both shapes together in a continuous path. I hope this video was valuable to you. If it was, please like, share, and subscribe to support the channel. If there's anything that you would like to see me cover on this channel, please let me know what it is down in the comments. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.